Media. Quick tips. So, you fancy creating a cloak of invisibility? Well, here's how you can do it easily with Sony Vegas Pro. First of all, you will need your cloak, which will need to be a strong green or blue colour. I'm going to use this cloth I got cheap from a market store. It should be ideal. Your camera will need to be locked off on a tripod so that it cannot move, because any movements will spoil the effect. First, shoot 10 to 15 seconds of just the background, what's known as a clean plate. Now, with the camera still running, walk into shot with your cloak and wrap it around yourself. Excellent! Now you've got your footage, let's edit it. Drag your footage into Sony Vegas Pro and using the shuttle buttons, identify the end of the clean plate, which is about here. Then press S on your keyboard to split it and move it to one side. Now, in the same manner, find the best take of your cloak waving bit and trim it to size. So now you should be left with two clips, your clean plate and your cloak waving bit. Now we need to place the cloak waving clip above the clean plate. So I'll just drag the clean plate here and slide the cloak clip on top. Now to make the cloak invisible. Shuttle the cursor forward until you have a good view of both the cloak and the person holding it. Now on the cloak clip, click the Event FX tab here and again here. Now select Chroma Keyer by double clicking on it. And there it is. Now if I move it out of the way so that we can see the monitor, we can see that the Chroma Keyer has already had a pretty good guess at the colour match but I'm going to try and tweak it even closer. So I click on the colour bar and I'm going to move the target cross around to see if I can get better transparency. There, that looks pretty good. And now just a hint of the high threshold slider like this makes a big difference. Excellent, I'll go with that. Now to make the disappearance complete, I'm just going to identify the points where these shadows here have disappeared and I'm going to add a fade up to that point, so that when it's played, it will fade to just the clean plate. And that's it, the effect is done. Just select, render to video, and this is what we get. There you go, Cloak of Invisibility. Well, that's your lot. If you've enjoyed this video, then please subscribe, like and share. And don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you don't miss new videos as they come out. This has been a Media Quick Tip and I've been William Hugh.